Hello there and welcome back to Dragon or Dragon Age Origins. Do you know what? I've started that four times, that intro. Uh, my name's Soccer Gloss. Welcome back. Okay, we're going to kick off. Uh, are you alright? Say something, please. Uh, Joan? Oh, I'm glad you're alright. They carried you in this morning. I didn't even realise you'd been gone all night. I've heard about apprentices who never come back from Harrowings. Is it really that dangerous? What was it like? It was pretty easy, to be honest. Um, it was... Um, it was harrowing. Is that why they don't tell us what it's about? I know I'm not supposed to know, but we're friends. Just a little hint, and I'll stop asking, I promise. Uh, I really shouldn't. Huh, so much for friendship. I'll leave you alone then. Oh, don't and be like that. you get to move to the nice mage's quarters upstairs. I'm stuck here, and I don't know when they'll call me for my harrowing. Come on. Uh, <laughs> I've passed my test, that's all I care about. Uh, this summon you to the test when you're ready. Any day now, probably. I've been here longer than you have. Sometimes I think they just don't want to test me. Um, what are you talking about? The Tranquil never go through a harrowing. You do the harrowing, the rite of tranquility, or you die. That's what happens. I think you uh, worry too much. You're starting to get... No, I can't see that. Uh, they're not going to kill you, Joanne. They might not. But the right of tranquility is just as bad. Maybe worse. You've seen the tranquil around the tower. Like a Wayne who runs the stockroom. He's so cold. No, not even cold. There's just nothing in him. It's like he's dead but still walking. His voice, his eyes are lifeless. Mm. I know a few people like that. Um... I'll watch for that next time I talk to Owen, yeah. He's been made tranquil. I don't know how they do it exactly, but you're cut off from the Fade. It takes away your magic abilities, along with your dreams and emotions. How awful. Apprentices can ask to be made tranquil if they fear the harrowing. But the Circle also forces tranquility on those they feel are weak. And sometimes they force it upon apprentices they think might be too dangerous as mages. I shouldn't waste your time with this. I was supposed to tell you to see Irving as soon as you woke up. Oh, okay. So the 20 minute conversation we've just had, you know. Um, I should go talk to him immediately then. You'd better not keep him waiting. We can speak later. Yes, we can. Thank you, Joanne. Do you hear anything? Is he alright? Is he awake? Why do you care? Are you best friends now? I'm just curious. That yep. Templar, Cullen, uh, said it was the quickest, cleanest harrowing he'd ever seen. I'm here. He must be so talented. I, I'm Someone standing. Someone sounds jealous. I just know I'm I'll be terrified when my time comes. Oh gosh. Like when okay. was. Let's go. He throw up every day for the next week. So uh, I think out. the map we gotta. Where are we gotta go? We gotta go see somebody. Where's the journal? The journal in the high tower of the mages. See what everyone wants from you. Join another cir circle apprentice. Roused you from your slumber this morning after the harrowing. After fretting about his own delayed harrowing, Yoan informed you that Irving would like to speak with you. Do not keep the first enchanter waiting. So let's go exploring a Did little bit hear? first. Hear what? I heard they suspect someone of dabbling in blood magic. Ooh. Why would anyone do something so stupid with a death sentence? I really so hate how the Templars are always powerful? staring at us. I heard Humbert volunteered to take the right of tranquility. Oh, oh, flashing chest. Buckle of the winds. Okay. Maybe I can uh, buckle of the winds. There we go. Plus three defense. Can't be shabby. Um. What have you guys? No, apprentice. My mentor says I have great potential. Oh, good. Oh, sparkly desk. I have a makeup. Oh, Apprentice Cowl. Five mental resistance. <laughs> uh, okay. Can I wear that? Oh my gosh! <laughs> uh, yeah, that's a little scary. <laughs> okay. I look like a... I don't know. A lollipop or something. Okay, where are we? Still trying to find this guy, Irvin. 
Oh, sparkly. Blank vellum. Fine treated lambskin, suitable for extracting illustration and script. I think we need some of that. Not sure for why, but uh must control the fire with your will. Keep the flames steady. We don't want it sputtering and leaping about. That's what causes most of the injuries. <laughs> injuries? Ah! But, but, Quick! Steady. Put it out. To your emotions. If you panic, it will. No, no, no. Breathe. <laughs> he set himself on fire. Uh. You know, in my experience, flint and tinder works just as well. Maybe we should start with that. Oh, that's hilarious. Is this the guy that I need to talk to? I hope you've spoken to the first enchanter. I'm trying to find him. Eager to see you. Who are you? Was the harrowing scary? Oh, I'm not it talking about it. I'm not allowed to talk about it. They call it. Do you remember what the chantry says about magic? Magic must serve man. I heard your harrowing went well. Oh, that's thank you. Wonderful to hear. I'm just a big head, really. I just want everybody to know that I passed my harrow. I heard Humbert volunteered to take the right of transfer. Whoa! If you put all my power behind that spell, you would have been obliterated. <laughs> I am not your enemy. Fear is your enemy. It is a weakness that can be exploited. I love this place. This is like, um... Like the most grown-up place you can be. Harry Potter school. This is my thumb craft in Minecraft. This is this is how I would like my, my thumb craft building to be. Uh, who are you? I heard Irving wants to see you. Yeah, I'm trying to find the guy. What's up here? As you say. As you say. Pause the game, spacebar. Oh, I see shiny things. Who are you? Oh, you're that Owain. Welcome to the Circle Stockroom of Magical Items. My name is Owain. How may I assist you? Uh, are you really a tranquil mage? I voluntarily submitted to the rite of tranquility. I was unwilling to undergo the harrowing. I find this state agreeable. Agreeable? Uh, you actually like being this way? I see the world with clarity. I remember the days when my mind was filled with inconvenient and seething emotions. Now things are simple. Hmm. And like now long you are no longer a person. My body is similar in form to yours. Possessing an equal number of limbs, appendages, and internal organs. I perform the same physical functions. My mind is capable of higher thought processes. Am I to be denied personhood because I do not feel as you do? Mm. A person is more than just physical parts. I have thoughts and memories. I remember my past, my childhood in the tower, and my apprenticeship. These experiences defined me. My lack of emotion. I feel like I'm picking on him, really. I shouldn't, really. Um, perhaps you are right. Uh, no, my statement was rude. I apologize. I do not have the capacity to be offended. Still, I believe I am a person. Okay. Um, what happened during the Rite of Tranquility? I was ordered to never speak of it. I cannot go against the Circle's wishes. Uh... What was becoming tranquil like? It is difficult to describe. I would perhaps compare it to being plunged into a pool of ice cold water. I should go now. Very well. <laughs> Goodbye. Uh, you are a strange fellow. Who are you? Good day. Oh. More of the strange fellow. Let's check the map. Is it on this level? Ah. Okay, so we need to go this way. No, we have to go all the way around by the looks of it. The would do something before it came to that, will they? I think some. Hello, congratulations on your heroing last night. Good work. Thanks, old chap. I appreciate it. Uh, what were you talking about earlier? Oh, the fraternities of the Enchanters. You probably have <laughs> heard of them. Enchanters. It's best not to get tangled up in circle politics. More trouble than it's worth, really. Hmm. Mm. <laughs> oh, sorry, and so did he. Okay, tell me about the fraternities. Come on. Uh, oh, they're found in all circles throughout Thedas. Groups of enchanters who hold similar viewpoints, who band together to make their voices heard. Okay. The most influential fraternity are the Equitarians. They are moderates and believe in a code of conduct that all majors should adhere to. Then there are the Chantry apologists, the loyalists. The Chantry says something and they follow it to the letter. 
The Lucrosians just want to make money. Oh, yeah, and I'm the Isolationists would like us all to be hermits and live on an island. Then, of course, there are the Libertarians. They want more power for the circle, more autonomy. Um, which one do you belong to? Huh. Well, if I had to, I'd say I was an Equitarian. But I ducked out of the fray a long time ago. Most of the senior enchanters are Equitarians. Irving, Wynne, Sweeney. Ulrid's a Libertarian, and a loud one at that. Ah, uh, mages have uh. enough opposition from the outside without tearing our circles apart with infighting. But what can you do? Yeah, what can you do, eh? Well, giving up doesn't help anyone. An idealist, I see. Well, if you're going to change the world, you should get started immediately. Lots of world to cover. Oh, I quite like him. Right. Yes, uh, let's keep going. What's in this one? That was uh, a cleaner. Oh, excuse me. I didn't hear you come in. Oh, that's a mage. I'm sorry. I'm terribly busy right now. I have to prepare the room before the Grey Warden is done at his meeting with Irving. Oh, there's a Grey Warden here? Yes. Duncan, his name is. <laughs> he must be here to talk to Irving about something important. Duncan. You know... I almost became a Grey Warden once. You're lying. No, I'm not. There were several of us chosen, though the Grey Wardens only wanted one recruit. Uh, they only ever have one mage, you see. I think they thought I was the best candidate, but I was young and foolish, and I said I wasn't interested. They picked someone else instead, and that was that. I've regretted it ever since. Ah, oh, well, I should get back to my work. Oh. Carry on cleaning. Um, yep, nothing else in here. Let's check out the next room. There's a nice flashy chest. A lesser lyrium potion. Lyrium potion instantly restores a portion of the user's mana. Only spellcasters can use it. Oh, I might put that on my bar. Uh, let's put that there. Oh, lesser health. We'll have that. Not quite sure when I pick that up. Uh, who are you? Ah, there you are. Oh. You are to be moved out of the apprentice's dormitory, and these are to be your new quarters. Oh, Tranquil I just will move your belongings this afternoon. I just Go stole on, my. Make own. yourself comfortable. Oh, thank you. Can I get in bed? No. My wardrobe. Can I put anything in? No. Okay. Thank you. For my new quarters. All right, who's this dude? Cullen. Greetings. I'm glad your harrowing went well. Uh, who are you? I am Cullen. I was to strike the killing blow if you had uh, become an abomination. Well, that's I'm nice to start off the uh, the conversation there, isn't it? Oh, yes. I, I was going to kill you, but I'm, I'm glad I never. Um, I guess everyone's got a job to do. <laughs> I try to serve the Maker first and foremost. As long as I am guided by his commandments, I cannot go wrong. Honestly, I've never seen an abomination or been called on to slay one. Oh, I would have been your um, your abomination virgin, I guess. But uh, sorry about that. So you could have made a mistake, maybe? Gregor would have guided me. Something must happen. But what if it's not obvious? Could abominations be walking among us right now? Uh, I'm sure there are no abominations here. This is still new to me. Maybe one day I'll be as dedicated and driven as Knight Commander Gregor. Uh, if you say so. You must be busy. Perhaps we can talk another time. Yeah, that, that's a weird conversation to have somebody who's just going to kill you. Uh, anything in here? Uh, oh, sparkly, sparkly. Blank villain, yep. Got one of them already. Who are you? I wonder how the king's army fared the last of them. Okay. Have a new blind. Sorry, I just see flashy. Lyrium dust. Use after inhaling lyrium dust, the user regains a small amount of mana. Only spellcasters can benefit from lyrium dust. Okay. Uh, we're just robbing everybody blind at the moment. I shall do it. Let's go. Ooh, deep mushroom, owl fruit, frost rock. 
Question, question of Frostbot gives a user a small bonus of code resistance for a short time. Cheer now fruit restores a small amount of health. Uh, okay, let's take all that. I guess that's ingredients or something. Who are you? Ah, oh, it's great to see you. Thanks. It's always sad when an apprentice fails the harrowing. I didn't fail. Just, just FYI. Uh, oh, you got a s oh senior in chat. Is this the one we got to see? Irvin? No, oh, Leora. Oh, it's you. I hear Irving's looking for you. Okay, I'm just trying to find him. Ah, this is infuriating. Another batch destroyed. Say, have you seen Owain? Is he in the stock room? Yes, he is. I just spoke to him. Oh, excellent. He wasn't there last I looked. I hope he still has some cinnabar lying around. When I asked last week, he said he was running out. Uh, I've got plenty in my chest in, in the... Uh, in Minecraft. I'll, uh, I'll remember to get you some. Uh, what was your name? Um, Mage? Yep. Okay, Mage. Uh, next room. This is quite profitable. What's in here? Oh, that's... That's that crazy guy. I think we've done a long... <laughs> gone the long way around. Uh, anything in here? Oh, there's somebody praying. Blessed art thou who exists in the sight of the Maker. Uh... What are you doing? Bless. Oh, <laughs> hello. <laughs> Hi, Rude. I'm reciting the Maker's blessings. Would you like to join me? Uh, I think not. I just wanted to. I uh, recite the Maker's blessings every day. It brings me peace in troubled times. Um, are you in trouble then? No, no, not really. It's just, a, I don't want to bore you with this. Go on, it's all right. I want to know. It gives me hope that one day the Maker will hear us. That maybe I'll be forgiven and my curse will be lifted. What curse? Magic. What else? Magic isn't a curse. Magic causes such misery. It's dangerous and vile and wicked. The Chantry must protect the world from us. Mm. Being born with something so terrible must be a punishment. I wish I could be rid of it. Uh, tranquil? Oh, you could be asked to make tranquil. That takes the magic from me? It does, doesn't it? Um, the chance she would appreciate one less mage running about. Uh, someone like you is better off tranquil anyway. Yes. Imagine. No fear of becoming an abomination. Not being reviled by common folk and chantry. I, I should go. My mentor only allows a few minutes each day for religious contemplation. Okay, we glad we had that talk. Probably wasn't the, the the nicest thing to do. Maybe the nicest thing would be to talk. All right, can I make you? A I heard about your harrowing. Congratulations. Oh. Thank you, Andraste Lily. Andraste must have smiled upon you. Yep, that's what it was. Right, bookcase. Oh, the maker. Bookcase. Okay. Uh, next room. Kind of feel bad about that person now. They're gonna have no feelings. Ah, here's where we want to be. Many have already gone to Ostagar. Wynn, Aldred, and most of the senior mages. We've committed enough of our own to this war effort. Your own? <laughs> Since when have you felt such kinship with the mages, Gregor? Or are you afraid to let the mages out from under Chantry supervision, where they can actually use their maker-given powers? How dare you suggest? Gentlemen, please. Irving, someone is here to see you. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> ah, if it isn't our new brother in the circle. Come, child. This is... Yes, Stocko. This is he. Stocko well, Gloss. Um, you're obviously busy. We will discuss this later. Of course. Well, then, uh, where was I? Oh, yes. This is Duncan of the Grey Wardens. Ah, that's the dude that killed those things in the intro. He's quite badass. Uh, is this why you had me summoned? Uh, pleased to meet you, Duncan. You've heard about the war brewing to the south, I expect. Duncan is recruiting mages to join the king's army at Ostagar. Okay. Uh, why? Mages are uniquely equipped to combat Darkspawn. 
Um, what are Darkspawn? They are twisted monsters that dwell underground where the sun's light cannot touch them. They have formed into a horde in the Kokari Wilds and threaten to invade north into the valley. I fear if we don't drive them back, we may see another blight. Duncan, you worry the poor lad with talk of blights and darkspawn. This is a happy day for him. We live in troubled times, my friend. We should seize moments of levity, especially in troubled times. The harrowing is behind you. Your phylactery was sent to Denerim. You are officially a mage within the circle of Magi. My what? My phylactery? Mm, what's that? You may not remember, but blood was taken from you when you first came to us. This blood is preserved within a phylactery. So they can be hunted if they turn apostate. We have few choices. The gift of magic is looked upon with suspicion and fear. We must prove we are strong enough to handle our power responsibly. Well, you I didn't give you permission to have my this. blood. I present you with your robes, your staff, and a ring bearing the circle's insignia. Wear them proudly, for you have earned them. Oh, thank you. Um, yeah, thank you. It goes without saying that you shall not discuss the harrowing with those who have not undergone the right. Yeah, now I got then, that. Take your time to rest or study in the library. Oh, I'll rest. The day is yours. Uh, can I leave the tower? Not yet. Oh. Remember, the tower's walls protect us as much as they protect others from us. I will return to my quarters. Would you be so kind as to escort Duncan back to his room, child? Uh, doesn't Duncan know where his quarters are? Being difficult, are we? You are an apprentice no longer. I expect you to set a good example. <sighs> oh, all right. The guest quarters are on the east side of this floor, close to the library. Now, if you'll both excuse me, I have matters to discuss with Gregor. Alright, Duncan, come on then. Me and my silly hat is going to take you to your quarters. Uh, M. Uh, where am I? That's me. I want to go there. Okay. Follow me. Do, 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 do. This way. Hey, Owain. How you doing, sir? Okay, Terra Jeff needs to make his mind up on what game he wants to play. <laughs> uh, this is it here. Thank you for escorting me. That's okay. You're this big badass grey warden, and you couldn't find your bedroom. Can we talk? Is there something else I can do for you? Um. Do you know anything about the tranquil? Tran <laughs> the tranquil? The tranquil. The mages whose connection to the Fade has been severed? Why do you ask? Well, do you think it's a bit cruel? It keeps them and those around them safe. Perhaps the sacrifice is worthwhile. I cannot say. Hmm. What's happening outside the tower? Ah, I imagine you don't leave very often, do you? No. We're not allowed to leave. I am not a good source of news, I fear. I am preoccupied with the Darkspawn incursion. Ah. Have you ever seen somebody use blood magic? Once, in my youth, just after I joined the Grey Wardens. I was traveling with my mentor. We encountered a group of Templars hunting a blood mage. They were quite far away, so I cannot be sure of what I saw. He forced some of the Templars to turn on their fellows. It was dreadful to behold. He would have escaped had he not overlooked one Templar who snuck up behind him and cleaved his head in two. Ooh. Did he use the walking bomb? Oh, uh, I wish I had that power. Be careful what you wish for. Power is treacherous. I've seen many people, great leaders, consumed by it. I am Stockholm. Uh, how many mages have joined the King's army? When the King sent out the call, the Circle of Ferelden sent only seven mages to Ostagar. I asked King Caelan's permission to come and seek a greater commitment from the Circle. 
Um, why didn't the, c the king come himself? The king must remain with the army. He is quite busy, after all. Ah. So how many mages would you, uh, would you need? I hope to place a mage or two within every contingent. I cannot do with just seven. Mages will make all the difference in this battle. The Darkspawn have their own magic, and our resources must exceed theirs. Hmm. So a handful of mages cannot be that useful? Mages heal. They can call fire and ice down upon the enemy, and so much more. I sometimes wonder if the Chantry's many laws regarding magic are necessary. Darkspawn are a greater threat than blood mages, even abominations. It takes decades for the world to recover from a blight. I wish the Chantry could see that. We must stop at nothing to defeat the Darkspawn. <laughs> ah, listen to me. An old man's rantings can't be very interesting. No, no, I, I've learned much from what you said. <laughs> you are too kind. <laughs> uh, hey, can you tell me more about the Grey Wardens and the Darkspawn? Certainly. I am intimately familiar with these subjects, after all. I think intimately is the wrong word there. Um, so what do, what, what do actually the Grey Wardens do? Our duty is to battle Darkspawn wherever they appear. We are elves, humans, and dwarves united by this common purpose. Ah, okay. Elves? Some of our most honored wardens have been elves. The hero, Garahel, the last warden to slay an archdemon, was one such. The Darkspawn threaten everyone. They do not distinguish between the races, and neither should we. Has Got being you. an elf in the circle been difficult? Um, a little. It is hard to change perceptions. I have tried to reason with many, and failed. If one has always seen elves as less than human, it's hard to imagine them as something else. It's just the ears thing they keep taking the mick out of me, but um, I am a mage now, and people should fear me. You should want respect. Fear is just a different kind of hatred. Hmm. Have there been many Darkspawn attacks? A horde has formed within the Korkari Wilds in the south. If they are not stopped, they will strike north into the valley. We Grey Wardens believe that an Archdemon is leading the horde. Um, Archdemon? Darkspawn do attack the surface in ragtag bands, but Archdemons are capable of rallying the Darkspawn, turning them into an unstoppable force. A horde of Darkspawn, a veritable army. It is dire news indeed. I fear this is what we will have to face. Mm. And the king is mustering an army to beat back this threat. Yes. Perhaps it will be enough if we play our cards right. Okay. Uh, I thought the Darkspawn were destroyed in the last blight. We can't seem to eradicate them completely. Somehow they always come back. Yeah. Um, why were Irvin and Gregor arguing about the war? It is not my place to comment. I'll go on. Please, I'd like As to As I said, it is not my place. Okay. Um, well, I'd like, to, uh, I'd like to talk more, but I have uh, of course. duties to Don't attend to. Don't let me keep you. That's fine. Thank you. Uh, oh, there's going to be a new thing. But before that, I think I'll end the episode here. Thanks, peeps. Uh, leave your comments and likes and all that jazz, and I'll see you all very soon. Ciao for now.